In this tutorial, we are going to convert between WGS, EG4, and QTM coordinates using QGIS. Welcome to GeoCarto, a channel dedicated to GIS, cartography, and geoscience. So subscribe if you want to get more tutorials. So you have a set of multiple points with their longitude and latitude, and I will use QGIS in order to convert those coordinates into eastern and northern coordinates projections according to UTM. The first step is to convert this Excel into a CSV file. In order to do this, head over to File and then click on Save As. Click on Browse and here name your file and then click on this Save As type and then choose CSV, Delimited. Then click on Save. Now we have our original Excel file and the CSV file that we have just created. Now go ahead and open QGIS and then head over to layer and then click on add layer then go ahead and click on add delimited text layer now we are going to import our csv file so click on this small button in order to add your csv file now we get to your work folder and then click on the csv file that we have just created and then click on open for the geometry definition for the x field we will set it to longitude and for for the y field will set it to latitude and here for the coordinate system our so by default QGIS is setting the coordinate system of your CSV file if you want to set it manually click on this button and here you can look for WGS EG4 and select it and then click on OK so I think that I'm good with my data so I will just click on add and then I will click on close. So now in order to save this WGS EG4 coordinates in UTM, so we are going to click on our file, right click and then go to export and then click on save features as. Make sure here that the format is set to comma separated value, CSV. So here you can choose where you want to save your output CSV file, name it and then click on save. So this is the most important step in here we will go ahead and set the coordinate system of our file so i will click on this button as you can see you can look for your coordinate system you can type utm here and you will get results so for me my area is located in the zone 32 north so i will just select it and click on ok so i will just change here in geometry i will set it to as X, Y, you can choose from multiple choice. So there we go. As you can see, this is the output CSV file. Here we got our X and Y coordinate or our Eastern and Northern according to UTM projection. Now we'll try to do the opposite. So we have those coordinates in Eastern and Northern in UTM projection. We will try to get WGS latitude and longitude coordinates so again i will save this file into csv head over to file click on save as then click on browse name it and then click on save open qgis again head over to layer add layer and then click on add the limited text layer go ahead and select your csv file and for the x field set it to eastern and for the y field set it to northern click on add and then close so now we will go ahead and export those coordinates as wgs h4 right click on your file go to export and then save features as the format is comma separated value here you can save your output so now i will change the coordinate system to w g s h4 choose this one i click on ok for here for the geometry i will set it again to as x y then we click on ok so there we go as you can see we got our x and y according to w g s h4 which is this is the longitude and this is the latitude 
So I hope that you got some value from this tutorial. If so, please like it and subscribe if you want to get more tutorials.